I am not ignorant of the facts embracing the situation. I read Time, Life, Look, Reader's Digest, True Confessions, Field and Streams, National Geographic, Saturday Evening Post, Red Book, Batman, Superman, Chicago Tribune, so I know whereof I speak. Tic Tac, suit yourself. One thing about working in the hospital, you get a lot of time to read. Everyone always leaving me their stuff. Magazines, newspapers, books, flowers, candy, all sorts of stuff. I got me a shoebox full of letters and greeting cards, pictures of naked girls, all sorts of stuff. People, they go home. They can't take their stuff with them. They leave them here for me. Finders keepers, I say. I got quite a collection. Playing cards, rubbers, packs of gum, all sorts of stuff. I used to never smoke. Now I smoke like the devil himself. Three packs a day. Of course, a lot of the shit I sell on the black market as I make out like a bandit most of the time. Got three goop girls working for me. Ain't nobody the wiser. They so beautiful, and they speak the American really well, and I love them so much, and the merchandise that moves fast, so I pay them well. When I go back to the States, <laughs> shit. I think I'll send for them. I love them so much. Raise them like they're my own. I don't let nobody fuck them, see? I ain't no pimp. This is strictly business. Need any drugs, painkillers, stuff like that for the trip home? 